In order to connect Geek Seller to your Walmart Seller Center, what you need to do is input API credentials from Walmart into Geek Seller. The best way to do this is to have them opened in separate tabs. From your Seller Center, what you will need to do is go to Settings. Under API, click on Consumer IDs and Private Keys. This will open up the Developer Console. From here, you will need to add a solution provider. You will go through here, find Geek Seller, and then just click Add Provider. This will add Geek Seller as a provider for your API credentials. You will need to go through and edit these credentials. Uh, we will need either view only or full access when available. Once you give full access or view only permissions on each one, you can save that. And then what you'll need to do is you'll need to actually copy these API keys before we can paste them. So click right here on API keys. This will bring up the client ID and client secret. So you want to click copy that client ID. Go back to the master panel in GeekZone. Go to integrations over here and it'll bring up this page. You want to click on add new integration and then you will click on Walmart. Once this is loaded, you will just want to copy and paste. You will just want to paste that client ID. Go back over here, get the client secret. You will want to paste that and then click next and go through the rest of the prompt. Once this is completed, you will have access to the Walmart panel where you could start adding products or you could import your products.